Hey, are you ready for some hunting on the Tommy Wilcox Show? Tommy Wilcox Outdoors is brought to you by Alabama Credit Union. Feel good about your money. Louisiana Farmers Warehouse. Go by and see my good friend Daryl Foray pick you up a Mahenja tractor or one of his top leading mowers. Tuscaloosa Toyota. One price, one place. Glencoe Equipment. If you're in the Gonzales, Louisiana area, go by and see my good friend Ty Jerby. He has multiple tractors to pick from, as does mowers. Top Shot Deer and Turkey Mix by Faithway Alliance. Ortec Tractor and Equipment in Nabu, Alabama. Greg can handle all your tractor needs of any brand, along with some of the finest mowers in the industry. Nelson Glass for all your contract and residential glass needs. Music courtesy of country icon, Hank Williams Jr. Hey everybody, welcome to Tommy Wilcox Outdoors. We got another great turkey show coming up for you today. It's been my pleasure uh, this year to finally get one of my high school coaches, Barry Bordelon, to come up and uh, hunt with me. He lives in uh, Mississippi, Carrollton, Mississippi now, so it's not that full of a drive, but he used to live in New Orleans when he coached me. And they coached me at Bonneville High School and uh, he played at Mississippi State and uh, when he was young. And uh, Coach Bordelon, Don Bonowitz, Willie Hoff, uh, Elton Legass. I mean, we had so many coaches. I mean, it was run like a, a college football program. I was so far ahead of uh, a lot of other people that came to the University of Alabama because they didn't have the, they didn't have the coaches that we had in high school. And uh, he played, Coach Bolon played a big role in my upbringing and uh, just a great guy. And he's in his late 70s now and got a bad knee and bad heart and everything else. But uh, we got him out there to hunt. And uh, it was an afternoon hunt. And uh, y'all got to check this out. Coach Barry Bordelon hunt with me in Alabama. Hey folks, we're in Alabama. I've got my high school coach Barry Board along with me. I'm gonna do a little turkey hunting this afternoon. It's about uh, three o'clock. We're coming in an area where we've been seeing a lot of tracks. Uh, we scouted this area. Lance Shores took some great pictures of some turkeys. I showed him the coach. <laughs> and uh, he said, man, I gotta come over here with you and try to get me a turkey. He says, I got a brand new shotgun. And I said, oh boy, here we go. <laughs> but uh, but Coach, good to have you on the show. I'm glad you could come to Alabama and we'll try to, try to get us a turkey together. I'm, I'm glad the weather worked out just right for us and it is really a pretty afternoon and I get to, I get to take my brand new gun. Uh, I've never shot a round out of it yet. Uh, it's a Henry. They, I think they just made this about two years. It's a crack barrel. Show them how that's uh, like. It's just an old crack barrel. Just a old single shot crack barrel, 26 inch barrel. Um, I'm afraid when he goes off with these heavy turkey loads, <laughs> it's going to get your attention. But I like a crack barrel gun, and uh, I hunt a lot of deer hunt with a 35 wheel and with a crack barrel, and. Uh, so I'm anxious. I hope we can get one. Yeah, get one to come in. Oh, Henry has, uh, Henry uh, rifles have been around forever since the Civil War. If you want to Google Henry rifles, you can look at it. And this is something they, they finally got into the turkey world and come out with this 12 gauge a couple of years ago. And you jumped to get one and never shot it yet. Right. And I and, uh, said, boy, that'd make a great show if we could call some turkeys in. And you could take one with a uh, with the Henry it'll, shotgun. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, it, it'll uh, be the very first round that comes <laughs> out of it. Only brought three shells. I know. <laughs> we were. We didn't even. We were gonna try to get out here early and just see how it shot. Yeah, you know? it. But uh, we kind of got behind. We had a detour on the road, and 
one thing led to another. I said, man, we got to get in the woods. And I was starting to worry we wasn't <laughs> going to get down these roads after that big rain. Uh, but anyway, uh, let's sit in here. Uh, I've, I've got a uh, shell camera that's out here, and a lot of times about uh, in a couple hours, they like to hit these fields, and the hens like to feed out. i got some top shot. Uh, deer and turkey mix out there, and, and all the, the clover is headed out. It's beautiful, man. It's got a great stand of clover in it. I was watching when we were coming across the field. It, um, that clover really, I'm not sure what kind of clover that is, but it really do, did well. Yeah, and it's going to come out, and they love to get out here in the afternoons and peck around. And if you can get some hens out here, the gobblers are coming. Absolutely. And uh, so we're going to sit. And uh, I, I outshot him on the quail hunt a couple years ago. Oh, my God. <laughs> and uh, so I'm, I'm a, I hope you don't miss. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to try not to. <laughs> if you miss, this will go down. Oh, I mean, no, we, we not, we're not bringing the camera back <laughs> if I miss. <laughs> All right, we're going we're gonna, to uh, sit back, call some, and uh, we're going to be quiet see if we can't get some birds to come in. You ready? I'm ready. Right. Let's do it. If there's a new mower in your future, you really need to visit the folks at Artec Tractor in Jasper. With brands like Bobcat, Cub Cadet, Gravely, Spartan, and Toro, they can help you find the mower to fit your needs. They also have a full parts and service department with factory trained technicians to support you after the sale. Located on Highway 5, just north of Jasper, on Facebook, or at artechtractor.com. Experience, selection, and friendly service are the reason customers keep coming back to Artec Tractor. Wouldn't it be nice if you could feel this good about your money, even after you grow up? You can with Alabama Credit Union. We offer easy, everyday banking and great rates on loans for real life. Plus, we help make the community stronger through initiatives like Secret Meals for Hungry Children. Because we're not just here to help with money matters. We're here for the things that matter to you. Alabama Credit Union. Feel good about your money. Faithway Alliance has been blending Top Shot deer and turkey mix since 2009 in Gunnersville, Alabama. Top Shot plot mixes provide deer and turkeys a high quality, nutritional forage for both winter and spring months. All Top Shot blends are coated with a cellar growth to promote healthy seed growth and increase your crop yields. Please contact your local ag retailer or call Faithway Alliance for all your Top Shot needs. Hello, I'm Patrick Hall, owner and operator of Hall's Feed and Seed, located in downtown Mountville. This location is under new ownership, yet we still have over 100 years of experience under our roof. Here at Hall's, we strive to serve our customers and community for all your home, garden, farm, and recreational needs. We offer a variety of products from pet foods to highway blends to deer mixes. Come by and see us at Hall's Feed and Seed. Y'all come, come see, see us at, at Hall's, Hall's Feed and Seed. And seed.
We at Louisiana Farmers Warehouse are proud dealers of the world's number one selling farm tractor, Mahindra. So when you're ready to invest in a new tractor, Louisiana Farmers Warehouse's friendly and knowledgeable staff is here to make sure your experience is outstanding. Choose any of the great Mahindra tractors from 20 horsepower to 125 horsepower and know that our certified technicians are here to support you for years to come. Call Louisiana Farmers Warehouse and get your Mahindra tractor today. All right, man, the old Henry, the old Henry did the deal. Old Henry, I keep calling it old Henry. That's a knife, let me slow it over. The Henry shotgun did the deal, man, look at that. Whew. I'll tell you what, you know when he goes off with that heavy turkey load in it. <laughs> <laughs> that awkward position there. Uh, that was, but what a beautiful bird, huh? Oh, man, they man, just. He come, uh, you called a little bit and he come, he started to blow up and uh, uh, he was just, he was beautiful. You could see his, him coming through the woods, his big thick beard and that, <laughs> he was pretty, pretty. Yeah, we uh, we just called a little bit and had some uh, hens come in. We knew he wasn't far behind and uh, he come in the field, strutted a few times coming in here. Not long, but enough to, that we knew the fire to get the Henry yeah, ready to roll, you know. And uh, you made a heck of a shot, man. That I'm was, telling uh, you, that had to be what 45 yeah. yards. And I was worried because you haven't shot the gun. Right. We don't know what kind of choke it came but with. It put some BBs and, in his head. I mean, it destroyed this turkey, man. Uh, so it surprised me. Of course, yep. now when he shot it, now he knocked <laughs> the camera over and. All kind of stuff, yeah, man. I was a little bit awkward <laughs> position. I'm gonna have a bruise in the middle of my chest because I couldn't get the gun over. Uh, but I was gonna shoot him. Yeah, that was a, uh, what that was a, a good afternoon, evening. man. Oh. Listen, you come from Mississippi. We, we've been talking about doing a right. turkey hunt together. And one thing led to another, not, never got around. We've done a couple quail hunts together and and then uh, you finally found a little free time. I found some birds on, on the cell camera, and boom, here we are. Yeah, it couldn't have been a better afternoon than that either. Easy drive. I didn't realize it was that from where I live in North Mississippi to here was just a straight shot across 82 and uh, got here in a little in no time. Me and Lance scouted this turkey uh, about a week and a half ago and got pictures of it. and. Uh, We'll run some of those pictures right now, but he's just a big old beautiful two and a half year old gobbler and uh, had four hens with him, man. He, yeah. He was the king of the yeah, roost around he here. So, but uh, congratulations and thanks for driving over, man. And Tommy, coming thank to you always. Me, it was a great trip. Uh, just what a beautiful bird to be in, in, uh, in Alabama. Uh, it was a real treat to come here and be with you. All right, we're going to take a quick commercial break. We'll be right back with us. Y'all stay. Stay with us. Hey, folks. Welcome back to the Tommy Wilcox Outdoor Show, Turkey Hunting. Uh, had a great time with Coach Bordelon, and uh, hopefully next year we'll be able to take a turkey again. 
Uh, I want to get as many of these on film as, uh, as I can. Uh, next up is going to be another hunt that I had. Seen a lot of birds. Had this turkey come in, uh, blowing up. All the things that you want, turkey hunting and calling. And uh, I was fortunate to get him in and get him on the ground. Y'all take a look. Hey everybody, Tommy Wilcox. I'm doing a little hunt in Fayette, Alabama today. Um, it's a beautiful day. I'm gonna be by myself, so I'm, I've kind of got this pop-up blind I put on the edge of a field. There's, there's a big uh, hill right here. In the afternoon, these turkeys come from this side way over here. They come down into this field and uh, they get ready to feed and do whatever they do. And they'll um, light up into those trees up there on top of that big hill where they can oversee this whole field. So, I'm gonna try to catch them in transition and uh, try to call a few up, and get them out here on the edge of this field after they come out these hardwoods this afternoon and uh, see if I can call one up for you and take him. You'll sit tight him. Get after him with the game face call.
Wow. That bird coming here just strutting, strutting, strutting. I'd heard him back. Heard him back on that ridge. And uh, as soon as I seen those hens come, coming, I just called a little bit and heard him gobble. And uh, that's all I did, man. I put my call down. I knew he was coming in. Here you go, man. What it's all about right here. Just uh, called to him with the Bama hammer. And uh, I don't know if you could hear it, but he answered me on that old logging road. And I had some hens come in here in front of him. And I was just mimicking whatever they did. And he gobbled at it. I don't know if you'll be able to pick it up on the camera or not. After I called and uh, once those hens started coming, I knew he wouldn't be far behind. And sure enough, he, uh, he come in here strutting the whole time. There you go. Bama Hammer. In the Birmingham area, look up Mark's Outdoors. They carry our whole line of turkey calls. But a uh, good two and a half year old bird, three quarter inch spurs, Come right on in. All right, we're gonna take a quick commercial break. We'll be right back with you. Y'all stay with us. Wouldn't it be nice if you could feel this good about your money, even after you grow up? You can with Alabama Credit Union. We offer easy, everyday banking and great rates on loans for real life. Plus, we help make the community stronger through initiatives like Secret Meals for Hungry Children. Because we're not just here to help with money matters. We're here for the things that matter to you. Alabama Credit Union. Feel good about your money. My name is Curtis Taylor and I'm a second degree black belt and the owner of Cobra Brazilian Jiu Jitsu in Tuscaloosa. Cobra is a martial arts school that offers adults and kids classes. If you're looking for Jiu Jitsu, wrestling, striking or Judo, Cobra's got it. Advanced or beginners classes, Cobra's got it. 5.30 a.m., noon, afternoon or evening classes, Cobra's got it. Come and learn to defend yourself, have more confidence and get in amazing shape. Check us out on Facebook or Instagram, call or come by today. We at Greensboro Farmers Co-op carry a wide variety of farming and household supplies. When it comes to your livestock, we've got you covered with our bagged and bulk feed. Need fuel? We deliver. Time to spray? Check out our insecticides, pesticides, and herbicides. Our variety of plants, flowers, and garden seeds will have your yard looking nice and your garden plentiful. Spreader trucks, buggy, and grain drill rentals will serve anyone's customized fertilizer spreading needs. Gear up for hunting season with our feed and seed, ammunition, and clothing. Greensboro Farmers Co-op. Small business, big heart. For over 20 years, people have trusted our tech tractor for their tractor or construction equipment needs. With brands like Bobcat, Mahindra, and Massey Ferguson, our tech tractor can help you find the right solution for your farm or the job site. Our tech tractor has a full parts and service department with factory trained technicians to support you after the sale. Located on Highway 5, just north of Jasper, on Facebook or at ourtechtractor.com. Experience, selection, and friendly service are the reason customers keep coming back to our our tech tractor. All right, folks, that's going to do it for this week's show. I want to thank Coach Barry Bordelon again from coming from Mississippi. And I want to thank him for playing a big role in uh, me coming up along with a lot of great guys at Bonneville High School. But he, 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 uh, he had played ball at Mississippi State. He knew what SEC football was all about. And, it, and, and they ran our program like a college football program. So the transition I had to make when I got to Alabama, I think 
enabled me to, to start out playing a lot faster than a lot of kids because we had everything that you need, whether it's scouting reports, whether it's watching film, whether it's off-season training, whether it's in-season training, whether it's, you know, summer programs and stuff like that. These guys, Coach Barry Bordelon, Don Bonowitz, and, and Coach Willie Hoff played a big role in that. And uh, so I want to thank them for, all of them, for uh, playing a big role in my success. And uh, I really appreciate you all. All right, folks, that's going to do it for this week's show. We'll see you next week right here on Tommy Wilcox Outdoors. Gassed up, loaded down, trucking on from town to town. Guns, bows, and a tackle box. Here come Tommy Wilcox. Hitting the water, hitting the woods. That Bama boy show got.